Hello everyone, welcome to the Z Accordion Pro plugin video tutorial series. Today I'm going to show you how you can customize the accordion themes. Make sure that Z Accordion Pro plugin is installed and activated into your site. You can directly click on add new or you can click accordion groups and then click add new to create a new group and give it a title. I have already created a few accordion groups for you. I will explain the rest of the video from the accordion groups I have already created. Go to the accordion groups and select the group you have created. You can see I have already given it a title and added a few content. Below the content section, you can see there are three different configuration tab. Initially, I am in the accordion settings configuration tab. Here, you will find the option to select a theme from 16 different theme styles. When you select a theme, you will get a customized preview of it, like this. If I select theme 4, then there is a customized preview of theme 4. If I select theme 2, then you can see the customized preview of it. But if I see the theme 2 design in the live preview, then you can see it is not showing like the demo. See, this is not showing like the demo. As I said, we have shown you the customized preview in the demo. You are allowed to configure the accordion color, expand and collapse, icon and almost everything for each theme. Let me show you from here you can do the changes. Let's configure theme 2. To do that, go to the display options configuration tab. And here you will find all the properties to customize your theme. First, you can see the expand and collapse icon related properties. You can choose an expand and collapse icon style from several options. Expand and collapse icon size, margin between the expand and collapsible icon and title, icon color, icon background color, icon background size, icon border radius, expand and collapsible icon position. I would like to keep the expand and collapse icon unchanged except the border radius. Let's make it to 0 pixel. Below that you will find the accordion title and description related properties. Here you will find the options to set accordion border, border radius, title icon, title icon size, title icon color, title background color type from several options, title background color, HTML title tag, title padding, strip HTML tags for description content, line break, description background color, description padding. There are so many options for you to customize the title and description section of the accordions. To make the theme 2 design like the demo you have seen we need to change the title background color. To do that let's pick this color. So this is the color code for this color. I am copying it and go to the display options and navigate to the accordion item and title description. Scroll down and you will find the option to set the title background color. So let's change the title background color to this one active background color to same same okay so now if i update the preview you can see it is almost same as the demo you have seen but now i need to change the text color to white to do that go to the typography settings and navigate to the item title font and change the title color to white And now if I update the preview, you can see it is showing like the demo you have seen. It is not necessary that you need to configure the accordions like the demo you have shown to you. You can set any title color, any description background color as you like. That's why we keep the themes flexible for the users so that they can create it as they like. Now go to the display settings configuration tab and if I change the expand and collapse icon style to this one and update the preview then you can see the icon has been changed if i change the color to this one active color to this one as well and update the preview then you can see the changes similarly you can customize all the themes as you like now let's publish the shortcut i have already published it to keep the changes I have just made, let's update the shortcode and go to a page where you want to display it. Insert the shortcode using the Easy Accordion Pro Gutenberg block. Select the shortcode you have just customized and you will get a preview of it. Publish the page and view it. You can see the customization I have made is showing in the web pages. So that's all for today. In the next video, I will come up with another attractive feature of the plugin. Until then, take care.